here. All right. Do you know today, on the the media that never lies. <laughs> Guess what? Um, the government has spent, they've been protecting the public purse again. Oh, they, they're such for a the good public. government. I mean, oh. would the UK be able to run without them? <laughs> Probably not. You know, we, we couldn't even wipe our own asses, could uh, we, without David no. Cameron? Well, do you know what he's done today? And apparently every household in Britain's going to get one of these leaflets. And it's called an in or out leaflet. Well, in fact, it says it is one sided, isn't it? Yeah, well, just a bit. Taxpayers will foot the bill for a nine million pound mind controlling campaign, oh sorry, government campaign, I think I was right the first time, urging voters to keep Britain and the EU it emerged so, last night. So they're, spe they're spending nine million of our money Public purse, yeah, to get us it. to stay in the EU. They're not they're not spending nine million of our money to give us a, a, a choice and say, look, this is the pros, these are the cons. There never is a choice. Ah, right. That's money well spent then, well done. Well done, government. Nine million, well spent. Do you know, absolute con congratulations to the wonderful government, government who know how to spend money. Anyway, this leaflet's very, very one-sided. Well, no how to spend it's our actually money. a 14-page booklet making a case against Brexit, which is Britain exiting. You know how much it costs to stay in the EU? 50 million a day. 55 million a day, something like that. Mm. So that's almost a pound a day for every man, woman and child in the UK. Yes. Think mm. about that. Leaders of the Leave campaign accuse the government of trying to buy the referendum. With our money! <laughs> London Mayor Boris Johnson, David Cameron's best mate at, at Eton. And well, number, number two soon, or it'll and, be number one and, soon, And, and will soon have his job, said, It's crazy to use quite so much taxpayers' money on stuff that is basically intended to scare people and stampede them in one direction. Well, actually, I've never heard him talking about that. Like that. But the opposition, because they're not there for us, government aren't. Yeah. And your local councils, your local authorities are not there. They're there for themselves and their mates. We've always said this, and when we challenge them, they just don't answer their questions. Like, are you committing fraud, yes or no? Four and a half years goes by, they still can't answer it. I wonder mm. why. Same question. I mean, they're not going to say yes, are they? But if they say no, we've got absolute proof that they have been yeah. committed fraud. Yeah. And they hire the courts and then force you into payment. So the uh, the devil or the opposition, if somebody walks a negative path, what are, the, what are the two weapons that they use against you? Fear. And poverty! There goes your money again. Straight down the drain. It's only nine million, though. It's not like, you know... We can't afford it. If we can afford to give the EU 55 million a day, then what's 9 million? Well, I'm hoping I'm getting one of these leaflets through the door. Uh, unless some government con about my house being unoccupied. Mm -hmm. Well done. Right, you're missing stuff out because we've got three channels. We've got Sri Lanka Sea. Marks along with an S and marks along with a C, and we put different videos on each one. So get ready, get uh, what do you do. You can look in the description and copy and, and yeah, paste. Yeah, but sign up to them, and that way you won't miss any of the uh, videos that we're putting out. Debt Free TV, in association with GetOutOfDebtFree.org.